What's going on guys? This is Snoob603 and Fake Filler, and welcome to another episode of our Battlefield 3 weapon reviews. Today, we're looking at the PP2000. This gun is available for all four classes and is unlocked after reaching rank 7. A little bit of weapon info for you guys on the PP2000. The country of origin is Russia. The magazine capacity is 20 rounds plus one in the chamber, but can be doubled to 40 rounds plus one in the chamber with extended magazines. The fire rate is 650 rounds per minute. The fire type is full auto and semi-auto. The reload time is 2.55 seconds with the bullet chambered or 3.5 seconds when the magazine is completely empty. And the damage for the PP2000 is 25 hit points of damage per bullet at 12 meters and trails down to 12.5 hit points of damage per bullet all the way up to 50 meters. The PP2000 is kind of a quirky gun. A passing glance at its stats would make you think that the gun is average at best, but looking at them in depth though, and you'll see that this gun can be extraordinary in the right situations. The best thing about this gun is its max damage range. At 25 hit points of damage up to 12 meters, it makes the PP2000 one of the more powerful weapons in the PDW class. It does have a smaller than average magazine capacity of 21 rounds, but once you unlock extended mags, this gun will really shine. The other added bonus is that it has a low reload time with at least one bullet chambered, so getting multiple kills in a short period of time is pretty easy with this gun, so long as you have extended mags. For the medium to long range, this gun performs decent. It's certainly not the best gun out there to be used in these instances, but it can definitely hold its own. Its very low vertical recoil makes it easy to burst fire your enemies at long range because you're not covering your target. My preferred attachments are any red dot sight, the laser sight, and the extended mags. You can get by without the extended mags, but the difference in this gun's capabilities before and after unlocking them is night and day, so it's really worth your time to unlock them. I'm going to give the PP2000 a 4 to 5. The only real downside to this gun is it's lower than average fire rate. It's not terribly bad, but it's low enough that you definitely need to get the first shot on your enemy, or you'll be hard pressed to win out most firefights. But the large magazine capacity with extended mags and the long range for maximum damage makes the PP2000 a formidable close range weapon. The PP2000 is one of those weapons that is loved by some and ignored by others. Personally, the PP2000 plays into my style better than some of the other PDWs. The PP2000 sports a low and slow fire rate at only 650 rounds per minute. There are only a couple automatic weapons that fire slower. However, this works well with the rest of the gun's statistics. The PP2000 has a small 20 round magazine, but with such a slow fire rate, you can maintain suppression fire for longer than you might think. The PP2000 also makes up for its slow fire rate with a relatively higher than average close range damage stat. That being said, the PP2000 does sport a long reload time, so super up close and personal spawn rushing isn't recommended. Once you add extended mags, you're up to 40 rounds per magazine and this gun becomes a beast dealing out higher damage than most of the weapons in the engineer class and straight up outclassing the damage output of other PDWs. I also tack on a Cobra Sight and Laser Sight to round out my loadout. I'm giving the PP2000 a 5 out of 5. The flexibility of this PDW really pushes this weapon to the next level. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up another Shusty Bang Battlefield 3 weapon review. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Overall, the PP2000 has earned a 4.5 out of 5 stars. Alright guys, as always, we're interested to know what you think of this weapon, so be sure to leave us a comment down below. Also, if you could give the video a like or dislike rating, we'd appreciate it. If you want to see what we think of other weapons in BF3, check out the description for a link to the entire playlist of weapon reviews, and thanks for watching. If you're looking for a little bit more shoosty bang in your internet, be sure to follow us on Twitter at twitter.com slash snoof603 and twitter.com slash fake thriller. In addition, you can find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash shoosty bang. Also, be sure to follow me on Twitch TV so you can catch up with all our live streams in the future. Twitch.tv slash fake thriller.